I want to say thank you so much for coming here because your government would really prefer that you stayed home and watched television. Um, because actual democracy, which is what's going on here, not what's going on in that hall down there, is actually very uncomfortable for this government. Now, a lot of people say, what difference does this make? You know, all these people come out and they all ignore it and carry on as they were. But what I think is that this is a message not just to this government, it's a message to the next government and the one after. Because it says, no matter what you do, we're not going to forget this and we won't eat this shit, basically. They want you, they would like you to forget, they would like to say that it isn't really that serious and that you should be more worried about terrorists than you are about them, but don't forget it. And don't let the next government think that you're going to forget it. The next government that comes in will be given a big budget, like all governments are, and will have a choice about where it can spend that money. This government has made the choice to spend a lot of its money not on solving problems, but on creating a whole new one, which is a Middle East in flames, basically. So we still have all the problems we started with, AIDS, climate change, the wealth gap, increasing uh, disaffection throughout the world, and now we've got the Middle East in a total mess as well. So really, we mustn't let this happen again. We must hold our governments to the idea that they ought to be changing things for the better. So thank you very much. Goodbye.